As always, we start with giving our flow a meaningful name. Now let's add a webhook. There are four authentication options for a webhook on our platform. But to keep it short and simple, I'm using the no authentication option here. Now, all I need to do in order to receive a sample and proceed with the flow is just to copy this link. And then I need to paste it in a new browser tab. Let's hit enter and this step is done. Now, to finish this flow, let's add some simple action component. Here, I'm using email. Let's not forget about the required fields conveniently marked with red asterisks. Now that we've finished our setup, let's publish the flow draft and start the flow. Now, as soon as you publish your draft, even before the flow goes live, you will see this link. From now on, when you want to trigger the execution of this flow, you will need to post your data to this provided URL.